So what I'm showing here is the double slit interference pattern. But what I'm going to do, what I'm able to do with the laser is if I move the slits across slightly, I'm getting a light going through just one of the slits only. And although it's difficult to see at the sides, this is the single slit pattern. As soon as it goes through both slits, we get the double slit pattern, so we get the interference fringes. And I'm sliding it the other way. Now the light is going through just one slit, which is the single slit pattern, that broad central fringe. And back to going through both. Okay, and it is possible um, to do this by sliding a piece of paper across as well. So I'm going to attempt to do that. It's very, very tricky. Momentarily managing to do that. Putting a piece of card over, just covering one of the slits. Now, considering the slits are a quarter of a millimetre apart, it's very tricky to do. But if I just cover up one slit, I'm just momentarily getting it where you can get the single slip pattern. Or we can get the double slip pattern. 